Yo, 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 how you doing? Hello. Flats, if you went 84 and 14 on tank and still lost, would you break your computer? I feel like that would just be another day doing God's work and still losing. <laughs> would it? But that's like extra God's work. You know what I mean? That's like an inconceivable amount of God's. That's like a, an amount of God's work that has never been done before in a game because no game goes for that long. I, I have mentally like unbreakable now ever since that losing streak me and Karki went on and I was like 38 and 7 and Karki was like 35 and or 32 or some shit and 6 and their tank was negative. He was like 13 and 15 typing tank diff when we lost. Ever since then, my <laughs> mental is unshakable. I cannot be broken. How did you lose that match? Like, what What could possibly happen? Uh, like both of our DPS were negative. One of them was like 11 hey, and 20. Gosh. 11 and 20? Oh, yeah. Jesus Christ. They were Christ. actually hack using our Widow at the beginning. They were like, your Widow's cheating after you got two kills. The guy finished the game like 15 and eight and, and like 19. I'm like, yeah, okay, man. Wait. They have uh, Seagull. Wait. I... <laughs> Perfect. I asked Sieg if he wanted to join after, and he goes, no, not anymore after that moment. <laughs> yeah, fuck that guy. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, now we invite him. Oh, that's the wrong... Wrong, well, wrong, wrong button, wrong button. <laughs> wrong button, wrong button, my bad. Hello. <laughs> Apparently, yeah, considering all the buffs that went through, I'm really upset that Junkrat doesn't get his two shot back. My boy yeah, two fuck shot. that guy, he doesn't deserve it. You wanna make it balanced? Make it so he takes, the, he can do a two shot, but they have to be airborne, so they take increased damage if you hit them. Make it balanced so that he has one HP. <laughs> so that if he tries to two shot you, you just fucking lick him and he explodes. <laughs> Guys, this whole turn is fucking kicking my ass! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> that was so such damage. a strong slam! Oh, the thing get back they've here. ever made was when they made it so that Torb can hammer faster, so you can repair his turret faster. That one just. <laughs> that one made me no happy. Panic. It's just so stupid. It's so no, funny. Watch him so hammer though. It's so fucking stupid! <laughs> <laughs> He's choking exactly already. Dude, it, hurts, it hurts killing him right now. Oh, dude, I'll be I'll be shooting the fucking turret from across the map, to, like tickling it, and this guy just starts hammering it and out healing the damage that I'm doing to it, and I can do nothing about it, and it angers me to no end. Seeing this stupid little guy just hammer his fucking turret over and over again, there's nothing I can do to kill him. Stupid robot. They should let Doom one shot again, in my opinion. Yeah, that's... You're off the deep end today. Old Doom was better. Yeah, I agree. Uh, yep, okay. Yeah, I disagree with that. You're crazy. Nice try. <laughs> 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 my miss tank form, Bastion. Hey, tank was cool. See? I got to throw one reasonable thing in to throw you guys off. I think that actually would have been a great opportunity for the, the Porsche collab. You know, just turn them into the car. The funniest collab of all time. <laughs> that would be so fucking funny, dude. You kill him. You kill that guy. He was one. Flats! You were the chosen one. You were supposed to Dude, you're going to break guy. your desk at this rate, Ruben. You got to be careful. I'm mean, instantly dead. Old Flats wins those. What? Now you probably mean Young Flats. There's a difference. Old Flats definitely doesn't win oh, those. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Retirement Home Flats does not win those. Dude, as I literally turned right then and there. there. Man, that hurts to hear. Dude, eat a brick. Fuck off. I just got back from spawn. God damn it. I hate being on the other side of this. Sorry, dude. Thanks to him. Shit, dude. There's just no way. Why? They just teleport into the room! Dude, I could handle a 50 cal to the chin. Yeah, I bet you could. How would you feel the pain? Your leg would be gone. No, 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 no. I think my shin would, like, deflect it. It's so hard. Like, what do you mean survive? Like, like they're sitting on hand, ready for medical attention, like, the second after it hits you? Like, no. Like, would you say ow or not? 
I say ow? I think I would say ow no matter the caliber bullet. I think you're a f***ing pussy then. <laughs> you tell me. What? You tell me you, don't, you would say ow to a five, like five, a true Californian. <laughs> you know what, Ruben? You might be honest with me. If I really like dig down deep and like I'm, I'm prepared for the bullet, I don't think I'd say ow to anything. That's what I'm saying! Dude, you guys are like one take away from starting a podcast. I'm begging you. If I had like a piece of wood between my face and put it down really hard, I'm pretty sure my yeah, hand would be down. Yeah, dude! Like, I don't actually. think I'd even flinch at a 9mm. If someone could wave one in my face, I'd be like, do it. Go ahead. I won't yeah! Do it. Okay, so what do you think is the largest <laughs> land mammal you could fight? I'm pretty sure I could grapple a moose. I, just I think like I could fight a bear. I think a tiger. Like a teddy bear? Three. I think I could take a gorilla. See, here's the thing. Humans evolved to use tools, right? We evolved to be smarter than everybody else. Um, so, so if there was a gorilla, I would simply, like, craft a spear out of sticks and stones. And then I'd fuck I that guy's I would give you a spear, up. Ruben, and I think you're still getting fucked up by a gorilla, dude. You're, you're no, still getting No, no, no. That guy is I'll getting I'll give you 10 spears. Smart. You're still losing. Okay, here's the problem with an elephant, though, right? <laughs> the elephant spears. is just so large and so dense and so, like, thick-skinned that I really wouldn't be able to do that much to it. Like, I could... And you're gonna do a lot to a gorilla? Some... No, yeah, because like with a with an elephant, I could like maybe at best shove some paprika up its nose and then like bother it. Paprika? But like, <laughs> yeah, dude, what is this logic? I'm actually just in complete a awe. Gorilla? A gorilla? I'd be able to like poke it really, really good with a stick and then it'd get fucked up. <laughs> and it also doesn't so know smart. how to arm wrestle, so I feel like I'd be able to beat it at that too. It doesn't know what the rules of an arm wrestle are. I could you're gonna you're gonna beat arm the wrestle a gorilla. <laughs> yeah, death. you should yes. start your own podcast at this point. <laughs> to the death. To the death. If you are in the median optimal fighting environment for whatever animal you're fighting, I feel like with a whale there is no common ground. It's either you're in water that's you're not shallow. fighting a whale though, like it doesn't matter. Like it... <laughs> it's just the only just problem with fighting whales is that there wouldn't be a fair playing ground. I mean, I disagree. I would take it as a water. I could, I could just like swim on top of its blowhole. Boom, I've already won. Oh yeah, and then you would suffocate it. Yeah, exactly. Wait, you're a genius. Wait, I'm yeah, not that I scared totally of sea beat the shit out of I'm a not whale. Gonna lie to you. Listen, I'm not gonna get scared of anything that was stupid enough not to evolve opposable thumbs. Whales will be whales forever. They're not getting. That's what I'm like. That's why I'm a little iffy about a raccoon. Like those guys, those guys don't know what's up. You're not scared of a gorilla, but you're scared of a raccoon. They got thumbs. Oh, gorillas also have thumbs. But like, listen, raccoons are shifty. You could hear yeah, a gorilla. They're, they're sneaky little guys. Like raccoons fighting a pack. Gorillas they could have rabies. I never heard a gorilla. Really, you just one v one that guy, and it's a fair fight. Someone in my chat is trying to argue this stupid idea that <laughs> whales can hold their breath longer than me. I mean, they could hold their breath longer yeah. than average humans, but me? Yeah, good oh. fucking luck with me, buddy. I win those. When Seagull said I was manually breathing, I stopped inhaling and just held it. I'm Ever right. since then, you haven't been breathing this entire time. Not a single breath. Yep. It's all just in one continuous one. That's a man of principle right there, fellas. Take notes. Listen, I'm just saying I beat Jump King. I want to see a monkey do that. Yeah. You know what? I'm stronger than a gorilla. Do you think a gorilla could handle the mental anguish of queuing 16 hours of ranked Overwatch? I don't f***ing think so. The mental fortitude we have could easily surpass most of my man. I am trained by the harshest conditions known to mankind. A gorilla doesn't have shit on me. I think I've gotten stupider as today's going on. Let's say fighting the gorilla in central Mexico. And there's a pizza in its powder form all around me. I take a handful <laughs> and throw it in its eyes. And the gorilla falls down crying immediately. Not only because his eyes sting, but because he was bullied with paprika as a child in Central Mexico, where gorillas grow up and the sheer remembrance of that trauma has rendered him vulnerable enough for me to win. So your whole plan here hinges on the fact that the gorilla has childhood trauma. With paprika, yes. We can make that happen. I see zero we can flaws with my plan. What's the biggest land, land animal you think you should take in a fight? Me? Yeah. I don't know. Like, definitely at least a large dog. I'm 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 rolling a large dog. Okay, you are you are putting the bar on the fucking floor right now, buddy. A dog? What do you mean? We're humans. We're weak as fuck. No, we're not. 
Have you seen the Well, you're underestimating yourself. I don't know. I was hoping you'd start at like, I don't know. Tiger. Tiger. Starting at Tiger. Or maybe? Polar bear. So, just starting at the top, you mean? No. It's not the top. It's a f***ing polar bear. Just a big, fussy little guy. So, what, what's the top then? I don't know, like, an elephant or a rhino. Do you think you would stand a better chance against a rhino or a hippo? Because I think... Well, I'd rhinos are beat blind as fuck, a... so... And hippos are yeah, extremely but... dangerous, so I would take rhino over what hippo the... any day. What the fuck are you gonna do against a rhino, though? It's like, got yeah, but armor. At least he can't see you. So if you, like, stand really yeah, still and don't fucking fall. spook him, you at least have a chance to live. A hippo will just fuck you up and just kill you instantly. Have you ever, like left the shower and moisturize that's like a hippo in its permanent state the skin is like kind of fragile because you can like no it's it not and dude like, it's like, are like underwater tanks yeah but like their skin is softer and you'd be able to do something they're to them they're not softer they're fucking yeah they dude. are dude they will literally I, know they are. I think hippos are like the thing that kills most humans in the world like I think it's actually yeah, but like those guys are just getting like out of any That's animal on the planet. I think hippos have the most kills of humans than anything yeah, else. Like yeah, you can have a gun and lose what they're doing, Probably, but, but I do. But I do. Hippos to shame, honestly. But that being said, have you seen how wide a hippo opens its mouth? Mm. That's a giant weak spot I can right make there. Worth my I know we've all played do? enough video games to know a vulnerable spot when it does that. So I first just... thing you do, you bait the bite, right? You get close, it opens its mouth, boom, weak spot open, paprika. That's, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> Thank you. Why didn't our ancestors think about just paprika? Spice you beers. think this so guy has ever so had paprika so in his life? No, paprika. that fucking hippo's the, getting the shit true on. The unadulterated weapon of, of, of man, paprika. Why do you think it was so expensive for so long? It's hard to get for Yeah, the it was the number one murder machine weapon of uh, humans against stupid fucking animals that can't beat them in a fight. What about, what about alligators? alligators? Oh, al okay, no. Alligators are unironically easy, and my proof for that is Florida as a state. Every single person is like taught in school how to take care of an alligator. Like, it's actually not a bad deal. Yeah, I, I feel like we can get that confirmed or denied right now. I don't think that's true. Yeah, I, I was it's not true. That. It's literally true. What? Ruben. What? We have a Floridian no. here. You must have, I'm a Floridian. You must have gone to some shitty private school or something where you didn't get no, taught how to find an alligator. <laughs> You'll never have to deal with alligators. Maybe they took it out of the curriculum. They took alligators out of the curriculum? A lot of practice for you. Uh-huh. Yeah. Why would they take such an essential life skill out you of the curriculum? You literally just run in a zigzag pattern? That's not true. And then you like close its mouth and then what's it going to do? How are you going to close it. its mouth? You just like Over there. wrestle it and you win. That's you just wrestle it and win. Just wrangle that shit. You win those! Ruben 2024. Just wrangle that sh**. <laughs> no, for that. real! You know, you just like take your index finger and your thumb. You put your thumb underneath their bottom chin. And you put your index finger on their snout. And then they're all like, right, Steve Irwin. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I don't know what all that. Why not? Well, I think it's different being able to do it in theory versus actually doing it. No, not it. in theory. I would actually do it. I'm going to sign you up for gator wrestling right now. Yeah, I would yeah. fucking farm Let's see them. It. Mm, I could take okay. A barbecue it's just a gator, food. dude. It's just like 90% of its day is just pretending it's a log, which is even easier to be. Now I'll tell you what I really am scared of. Bullet ants? Holy shit. Terrifying. They named themselves after a weapon of humanity. That that says intelligence. I don't know. I don't I even think I could take another guy. human in a fight. So I, no, humans are so easy to beat. Okay, <laughs> you got wait, every country. <laughs> you have every country. Somnus, Somnus, Somnus. What is the biggest animal you could beat in a fight? Let me think about it. Really give yourself every advantage here. Honestly, like a turtle. Lance is currently stuck on dogs for some reason. Large dogs. I would say I'd, I I could beat a large dog. Win. I think I can definitely beat a leatherback sea turtle. I mean, it is just a frisbee with a mouth. Oh, or maybe I could beat like an albatross. <laughs> Dude, I'm not gonna lose to a albatross? guy who loses to fucking plastic straws on the regular. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> no. Oh, I could probably also beat like a what is this? Oh, a coconut crab, maybe, but they're disgusting. So I don't know if I want to get close to them. Okay, what about a polar oh. bear? A polar bear? Ruben, are you insane? You should, no. you should have been hearing them all night. It's been crazy.
Personally, Bro, I don't think I would fight a polar bear. I think they'd beat a, a gorilla if they had a fucking handful of paprika. Uh, Ruben, my, my brother in Christ, you could not even beat like a big dog, like a pit bull. Like you would absolutely get fucked up. Dude, those guys are dumb. Ru Ruben, Ruben, I Ruben. Ruben. Them. <laughs> Ruben. Have you, you seen have how like, muscular I am? You have like stilts for arms. You're I not beating any of them. I literally have fucking meat mountains <laughs> fucking placed yeah, beneath, beneath my on. shoulders. You're really underestimating us for some reason, and I'm not sure why. Right? I don't know. You know what? I'm gonna. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna. I'm gonna be. I'm gonna I be mean, fair too bold, and go I understand. To this guy's like two years away from listen, croaking over, I've but like me, I'm young and strong. Listen, I'm gonna go check out your stream, too bold. You better flex. I'll be there in two seconds. Start flexing. Me? I don't need to flex. I'm naturally flexing. Ruben doesn't even have the bottom part of a mustache yet. He doesn't even have a beard. I already oh. have that. <laughs> I have no knowledge, man. I've got I have it. the middle the part of a mustache. What does that Ruben, mean? Ruben, you groom See, your mustache too much. Honestly, right, you're wearing a There's hoodie a and like fabulous. and like the surrounding area around you, like all that. You know, you should probably clean your room, but that's besides the fact that everything... Moved. Oh, okay, never mind. Okay, I take it back. But, you know, the, the boxes behind you don't, like, flatter you. They don't make you look tall. They make you look, like, 5'9 at most. So I'm not oh, sure. That's actually like a compliment. I'll take 5'9 any day of the week. Oh, that's no. fantastic. Thank you very much. I Too appreciate it. Too bold is 6'3. Guys, so guys, guys, other question. Other if we were animals in the kingdom, what type of animal would you be? Um, The king. Godzilla, obviously. I'd probably be a cat. I'm not gonna lie. That's, That's so pretty good. Be a big cat. I I be a big cat. <laughs> cat. Then I would feel more safe. Like I would probably take like a leopard or something. Yeah, like I'd not a like too a big cat. Or something. Maybe, maybe a tiger or like a leopard. Yeah, I would take a big cat. Maybe a rich person's mm -hmm. dog. Yeah, yeah, I'd be a rich person's I, cat. I oh, you could be. be you guys could be my cat. You know what that means? Every couple day, every couple hours, when you like shit yourself, I get to clean your butt. Awesome life. I, I couldn't think of anything more terrifying. It's because you're fluffy, no?